Welcome to All Class Driving Academy. In this video, we will learn how to perform an in-cab inspection. Always make sure that our yellow and red is out before we perform the inspection. Now we will check if we have proper paperwork for tractor and trailer. First thing we will check is our registration that is present and valid. We we'll take a look at our insurance. Then we will take a look at our CVIP. Make sure it is valid. Next, we will check our safety fitness certificate. Check to make sure it's not expired. Next thing is our schedule one. It tells our major and minor defect of tractor and trailer. Same goes for our trailer. First, we will take a look that we have proper registration, proper insurance, and CVIP that it is valid. Next, we will check our seat belt. We'll grab the seat belt and look for any damages on it. Then we will latch it onto its place. Then try to see if it locks in its place. Then unlatch the seat belt and make sure it goes back to its place. Next, we will open the driver door to make sure it opens and close it to confirm it closes properly. Then always lock the door. Next, we have window glass switches. One for the driver and one for the passenger. Next, we have our mirror controls. So there's a toggle switch that controls left mirror and right mirror. Before leaving, always make sure they're adjusted to the driver. Next, we have our lock unlock switch and window defrost switch. Next up is our headlight switch, dimmer switch to dim the intensity of the dash lights. Then four wheel flasher switch to engage four wheel flashers turbo gauge coolant temperature gauge oil pressure gauge rpms diesel exhaust fluid gauge speedometer diesel fuel odometer Air application gauge, primary tank, secondary tank, left signal switch, right signal switch, and high beams. Engine brake switch, and always make sure engine brake is off within the city limits. Next is our windshield washer, fluid and wiper switch. Parking brakes, differential lock switches, trailer service brake, temperature control, fan speed control and window defrost. Always put a hand on top of the air vents to confirm air is coming out of the window defrost. Airbag inflate and deflate switch. City horn, highway horn. Steering wheel adjustment. Both telescoping and tilting. And always make sure that it locks in place. Nothing underneath the paddles. Clutch. Brake, accelerator, range selector, splitter, differential switches, traction control, fifth wheel slide, airbag inflate deflate, and fifth wheel unlock. Differential temperature, rear differential temperature, engine oil temperature, transmission temperature. Three equipments must be present in the truck. First aid kit, triangle flare kit and fire extinguisher. This concludes the in-cab inspection. Thanks a lot for watching.